we're going to make a little um, stitch sampler. And a lot of people like to take these and turn them into backpacks for their ugly doll. So it makes a nice little pocket. Um, but we're going to learn how to do two kinds of stitches. This is a straight stitch and this is called a whip stitch. So at each table we've got these little sewing kits and there's going to be four of these little pieces of felt so each student should have one of these and you've got six pins and you've got a needle and then you also have some embroidery thread and then there are also these tools you got to be careful not to stick myself with the pins these will help you thread your needle. Um, so what you're gonna do is take some embroidery floss and you got a threader and I've got this piece of fabric and I'm just gonna fold it up so it's about you know fold about a third of it so then I can have it like this and um, I'm gonna take a straight pin and very carefully put this here and here and here and here and some people like to have another one here I should be okay if I just have these two like this and then you're going to, this is um, called a bobbin. So um, it's got the little end here and there's a little uh, notch. So you want to pull from that end and then you want it to be probably about twice an arm's length long because you're going to um, double this up. So I'm going to pull this aside and measure. And then I'm going to just try to get a piece of it back into that little notch there. All right. So now I have enough thread. I'm going to take my needle, so it's a little longer than the pins. And I'm going to put my threader in it. And this is this, I'm going to take the smaller one. And I'm going to push it through the eye of the needle. So there's a little hole here. I'm going to get that guided through and then you take your thread and you put it over on the little hook and you're just going to pull the hook very carefully through. So now I've got that threaded on easy peasy. And before I lose this I'm going to put it back in the little kit. All right. Then you want to line up the ends the loose ends of the thread. So all you do then is have the needle go all the way to that side and then um, make a little loop and pull that through and you should have enough of a knot to hold for felt.